Hello YouTube, it's Mod here, I'm playing FTL again, and I've got a friend with me! Hi guys! Are you getting sick of me on this channel yet? <laughs> yes guys, I've invited Talk333 to join in with this, he's watching this via his uh, Skype, and um, well, he's going to give me some co-commentary I suppose, right bitchface? Basically I'm a backseat driver. <laughs> yes. So let's just have a look at the ships I've unlocked so far, we've got the Kestrel Type A and Type B. I've, yeah. I've completed the game with the Red Tail, as we saw in our last series. That was fun. <laughs> this ship is one of my favourites, the Stealth Cruiser. It's a yeah, pain, you... royal pain in the arse to use, though. Yeah, yeah, you, you, you died pretty badly. The Mantis A is what I'm swinging towards for this run. It's uh, good for boarding, um, mm. but I would, I would, apparently the Mantis Type B is a good one to use, but eh, I'm not going to lose any sleep over what, that right what's now. What's it got in the way of weapons? This. Mantis. Small bomb, bomb, which takes out systems and a space glazer, so weapon wise, it's absolutely rubbish. And you've only got enough power, whereas the, here, only enough power to power up one at a time. So oh, that, that, yeah. Horrendous. I've, I've heard that they're great for boarding, and I saw in your last playthrough that boarding seems to get you shitloads of scrap, but you get kind of fucked against the AI drones, which is what you come up against first. So, uh, you do all right, so long as you know what you're doing. <laughs> uh, the the, top, the yeah. best run through, one of the best run throughs I've had has been in that ship, uh, the Taurus. Uh, I'm not a fan of it, to be honest with you. The the yeah, I, I, to be fair, I went in with it not being much a fan, but it was the only other ship I, I unlocked, and I really hate the standard one, and um, because of that, <laughs> that's all the also the only one I've got the Type B of. <laughs> <laughs> Think of ships, this is the, the ship we unlocked for completing the game in the last playthrough, the Osprey. Uh, and as you can it, see, I've been playing the game since I last uh, uploaded a video to YouTube, so I've got the Type B. Type B? Fuck. What's, what's that like? Don't know, truth be told. <laughs> it's got level the, 2 artillery beam. Level 2 artillery beam. Um, that's it. It's got dual lasers in the Leto. Missile launcher, yeah. whereas the other one's got burst laser two. Yeah. Uh, it also seems to have less rooms. It's got one oh. less crew. Yeah. Airlocks there and there and in the middle. Mm. And what else have I unlocked? We've got the Zoltan ship, we can skip that. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm swinging towards the Osprey or the Mantis ship. Mm, I think the Mantis ship's going to be hard, because, like I say, with the AI drones, and I, I do want to see the Osprey. You want to see the Osprey, do you? Yeah, that, that's like the pinnacle of the, the, the Federation's technology. Okay. Um, um, should we play this an easy or normal? That's up to you, man. I, 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 don't, know, I don't know about that. Well, it depends I'm, how good you feel. I've never ever completed it on normal. In fact, never ever played it on normal, so should we... Go in at the deep oh, end. Oh, this could be deadly. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Actually, you know what I've gone and forgotten to do? Uh, I want to rename the crew. I'm, I'm oh, yeah, special. Yeah, that, that's kind of like... That, that's half the fun of it. Watching your friends die. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> um, no, I get really attached to my crew. I It really it really kills me when 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 one of them goes. Like, the furthest I got, um, it was actually one of my original members of crew that managed to make it right the way through the end. So in my head, he was like, I'm fighting to the last blood to save my, to avenge my friends. <laughs> oh, uh, you... We're called the Ascending Failure, spelled <laughs> really, really wrong just to get the point across. Yeah, yeah. We shall uh, call the Mantis Tort. <laughs> in, in memory of 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 the valiant warrior taught from your other YouTube run. Yes, uh, I will be the NG. That was easily done. <laughs> I'm not a fighter, I'm a lover. I like to tinker and do mechanical things, such as trying to fix computers that don't want to be fucking fixed. Yeah, I did find it strange you put me as a fighter, because like me myself, I'm not a fighter. You have the mechanical, so, it, you have the mechanical capacity of a flea. I'm not that bad. Your computer. How long is your headphone jack broken on your computer for? Is it still broken? 
Thank you, I win. <laughs> that just because it needs replacing, really. And I can't be arsed. Let's it needs to split apart. Ah, oh, what's going on there? So many numbers. <laughs> I can't I can't even remember the numbers he uses. I I but I have a terrible memory for numbers. <laughs> what's going on? Oh, I don't know. This is the ascending failure and then some. Right, yeah. Okay. AO203 4040, otherwise known as. I, th I actually thought you were going to spell all our names wrong to go with the theme. <laughs> well, you can see there it's just gone AO203 40 dot. 40 yeah. dot is now his name. I like that, 40 dot, that could work. <laughs> and what should we call the rock? Um. Ah, uh, what, what, what? Do you, you know what? You're a Wednesday friend, if you know what I mean. Who, who, who we sometimes go round. What host. was it? Yes, yes, the host. Do you, uh, do you know? Yeah, yeah. And Jay, so we have. A he's all, three, four, like in two, any four, in any role play game I've played with him. He's always a goddamn tank. He's like. Yes, that's actually perfect for him. Yeah. <laughs> so we shall stick you. Oh shit, wrong one. You can go on the guns for now. Uh. Who's that? That's AO203. He can stay in the driver's seat. I'll stay on the I, engines, and we'll put NJ on the shields for now. Yeah, I, 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 th I, th I think uh, 40 dot works really well as a pilot. That, that's out, 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 of, out of our little friend group. He, he's the one that I've known for driving the longest, so <laughs> it, it works. Oh, I, we can, only just on the beacon yeah. map here. So to, to, to be fair, I think you or him like work as pilots, because because I always associate you with your car fanatics. <laughs> what can I say? Anyway, let's just jump into this, shall we? I've got okay. the systems on the ship, so we've got a bit more engine, and our guns are actually online. AI! You detect an automated rebel scout attacking a small refueling outpost. We shall intervene to defend the outpost. Oh, this power. This up. is where we would have been butt fucked if we went for um, the mantis. Oh yes, quite heavily. So let's just uh, use burst laser. I might also have auto fire on. Yeah, I want more normal as well. This, I'm... the difficulty is exactly the same. The only difference, supposedly, is the rewards. So I've oh, got no right. problem completing the game, but that was with. But I think it was by sector six or seven. I had a maxed out red tail. At this point, I might actually do the right thing, shooting for their weapons. I think I am. And how many shots does the burst laser get? It gets fire three lasers, one damage each. So yeah, we'll go take out their guns. Take out their guns, then their shields. And meanwhile, we got the artillery beam here, which will take a whole 50 seconds to power up at the moment. Ouch. There we go. <laughs> there we go we'll take out that. Shields next. Oh, so what's happened? Our shields been ionised? They did have yeah. an iron archer. Oh, they just oh, missed. Right. Thank God for that. Right. Go for weapons again, yeah. Yeah, weapons again. <clears throat> let's, uh... Alright. Boom, boom, I've, boom. I forgot we... So, so it doesn't actually take up a weapon slot, then, the new... The, new... the artillery beam, no. It's its own independent... Just, just here. All on its own. Alright. Ah, oh, but it's got a system room, so I guess people will target it. It's entirely possible. Mm. And the crew defeats the ship. The cr ship breaks apart and you quickly salvage what you can't. Can. Missiles, drones, and scrap. I don't like using drones, I don't know about you, but I find drones tricky. Mm. And it's just Ooh, an extra resource a, to worry That's about. a point. It, it, it's got a room, is it manable? That. Or, yeah, is there any way to find out? Other than sticking a man in there. Um, If I hover the mouse over the artillery beam, as I'm doing at the moment, it ah. uh, automatically fires one damage beam that pierces all shields. Alright. Oh, but if you look on here, it says status fully powered man by crew. If I move you to this room real quickly, then you'll see currently unmanned. Implying. Ah, uh, right. There we go. So if we just jump now into. Oh, let's go that way. We want to try and zigzag our way across the map as best as possible. Mm hmm. Let's aid the civilian ship. And if we can get a preloader, then we can sit in a system, load up the artillery beam, jump into the next fight, assuming there is a fight, and then... Oh no, wait, we don't even need to do that. You, you jump into a fight and then it automatically is... These will automatically be fully charged, ready to go. Yeah, yeah. Well, at that's, least the cool. do, I don't know about the artillery beam. Yeah. That, that, that's what I was about to ask, actually. Yeah, I didn't know if it would work for the artillery beam as well. And the son of a um. bitch has cloaked, so that's going to be our priority, as soon as he uncloaks. 
Although I also think getting more weapons is big and clever. Um, I actually, I actually, the setup oh, I like. Oh, what a cock. We don't need uh, to Go, go right fix now. it. Don't need it right now. Hmm. What was that? Shields. That's okay, you're in there. Um. I th don't rock. Don't rocks repair slower than normal? Uh, I don't think so. No, no, it's Mantis that it's repairs Mantis slower. slower. There we go, so their weapons disabled at least. But I like the rock animation for when they're fixing anything. They just look like they're smacking it. <laughs> they pretty much are, they're using brute force. Beating yeah. your back into shape! <laughs> Everyone else gets out a little spanner and cranks it. Rock, <laughs> no, smash you. <laughs> smashy, smashy. We've taken a little bit of damage here. Mm. So, come on. There we go. Artillery beam but, is um, back online. The weapon setup I actually like is to get as many fast firing weapons as possible rather than. Um, like, I, I liked having loads of burst lasers. That's not bad, actually. As long as you can actually power them, then yeah. Yeah. Range. Okay, let's go to... I, I, I was flying around and I had the option for like more powerful weapons, but they took longer oh, to charge up. You didn't hear that, then, well, did you? No, I can't. I massive, can't. I... Massive thundercrack in my ears. Uh, <laughs> sorry to interrupt your mid-flow, but you jump into the middle of a plasma storm. Multiple recently incapacitated ships loom in the shadows, briefly illuminated by the lining. At the moment, we are currently on half reactor because of the special effects that are in at the moment. We can manually search the wreckage for survivors and equipment or avoid the risk and wait to jump away unscathed. At this early stage of the game, I'm tempted to just jump in. Yeah, we got yeah. To lose at this point. Let's go for it. Oh, a bit of risk. <laughs> Standard. Um, the lack of detection equipment has uh, allowed debris to crash into our ship, damaging the hull. Uh, we've salvaged what we this can. This is something we need sensors for. We do have a decent amount of salvage, but... Uh, yeah, that's cool. Oh. What's happened here? Engines are offline. Yeah, the, the, that that power drain has hit us hard. You're gonna have to take the weapons offline. We also can't breathe. I was trying to right-click the actual weapon, the uh, icon rather than the weapon. So, we, we... lack of breathing isn't an issue. Lack of breathing, not an issue. Let's go there. <laughs> is is there any races that don't breathe, like rock? Because I know they're immune to fire, but we have a potential problem. We are in an asteroid field, so to cut an asteroid field against a Zoltan ship. Mm. We've got no choice but to fight at this moment in time, so let's put you back on. And you. That'll have to do for now. And I don't think the FTL's going to charge quick enough for us to get out, so let's just stick with it for now. Yeah. Yeah. It... I can certainly see that Easy is a lot, is, is a lot more uh, generous with its handouts. Yes. Oh, our medi bay is out, but we need to keep NJ on the shields now. Oh shit! Hull breach. If you if you go run, deal with it, you're the you're the fastest repairer. And O2 is now down, but I need to get the engines back online. Yeah. Oh. Come on, FTL, medi bay is Let's take you off there for now. I'm not going to stop blowing holes in my ship. One artillery beam. Come on. There again, I, I'm I'm OCD yes, with stuff done it. like this. I, oh, my <laughs> weapons! Is there a safe beacon we could jump to nearby? Please, there's a store we can jump to. No. Ah. Uh, oh, we have no idea what we're jumping into because we've got no long long range scanners. We're never, oh, oh, this is a typical slug wanting a crew over, a crew member handed over. We couldn't stay. No. We couldn't stay repairing the asteroid field. Otherwise, we'd have stayed behind and make sure the ship was okay. But we will never surrender oh, one of our character slavers. You should. I think you should run to the weapons now. How bad is the O2? O2's nearly up. Yeah. I mean, it will take me longer than you, but. Come on. Come on. Right, for now you can man the engines then. O2's back online, I'm happy with that. Oh, oh shit, I forgot the late missiles are still offline. They've ionised the shields and they've just fired lasers and missed everything, thank god for that. Lasers back online, apparently burst lasers are manned. No! What's that 
then. Um, has he not? Oh, there we go. It's manned now. Uh, let's just hit the weapons. Oh. I think you should swap us because I'll 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 give the better uh, bonus, won't I? Because I've been stage... using it. Some... Let's just worry yeah, about the more, the more I use it, the more skill I'll get. Let's just worry about getting oh, no. the kills first. Sure, yeah, we yeah, need to get sure. the medibay repaired. Ah, stop blowing holes in my ship. Right. You win, for now. Well, you could repair the medibay while... Oh, I suppose we do need to man the engines to get some more evasion. Oh, artillery beam's nearly ready. Are you ready for this? Oh, okay, let's go. Would oh, we surrender. Take one of our slaves as tribute. If you destroy us, they'll all die anyway. Do we take a slave? I've I've often found this moral choice a bit weird because it's like okay, I'm accepting slavery, but if we kill them, they do all die. We're not accepting uh, a slave. We're freeing a slave. Well, I suppose we are freeing a slave. Uh, and crew could be handy. We've got the extra member of crew, which is very handy right now. So, what race? Human. Sambo is our newest crew member. Right, we need that back online, and you guys jump in there and help out as well. And meanwhile, Sambo, get over. Th Actually, Sambo, wait there for now. Taut, you're pretty useless at repairs. Yeah. Well. Yeah. Um. <laughs> Let's get you both in there, and meanwhile these guys are about to get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Medibay isn't turned on right now, so we'll turn down the engines a bit, turn up the Medibay. Oxygen seems to recover to a sufficiently high level, yeah, so... Yeah, you are quite fucked at the moment. <laughs> well, so am I. Everybody's a little bit toasty at the moment, shall we say. Yeah. So, AO203, back on piloting duties. NJ back on shields, mod on the engines. Let's get everybody back up to health. Oh, we're under half hull actually now, I've just realised. Yeah. And I'm I'm betting even if we find a shop, repairs are gonna be costly. Yes. Did we not have shields? We had one level of shields, now we've got two. I wanted to get that one Oh yeah, but we haven't got power for them. NJ, why are you there? Get to the shields. Thought of some full health. Sambo, where can Sambo go? Sambo can float in O2 for now. Power down Medibay, power up shields. If need be, we could turn down the artillery beam and power the engines for a bit, but. Still no stores nearby. This run isn't going too well. What do you mean, not so going I... too well? We haven't died yet. We're not far off. But we do have two levels of shields, which for Sector 1 is pretty damn tasty. So, mm. we'll uh, burst laser on... Oh, they got an anti-ship drone. Enemy defense. Shoots down missiles and asteroids. We're alright. So, let's just go straight for... Well, they've got one yeah. level of shield. Burst laser weapon sounds good to you. Yeah. Um, the burst laser should take out their one level of shield. Then we can stop their shields from coming back up and then carry on the um, weapons. Yes. Boom, boom, boom. Now we'll take out the shields. Then we can proceed to rape and pillage asunder. <laughs> oh dear. They don't appear to be making any attempt to fight back. Oh, we don't want that back up, so... We'll... I think one of the best setups I had was when I was flying with like four level one burst lasers or something. Because they ended up firing faster than the burst two, and it, so it was just like getting off shots before the enemy had a chance. Almost game over. Artillery beam, ready, aim, and fire. There you go. Hey. That's a bit overpowered, is that artillery beam? Uh, How much damage does it do? Does it say? There you go. It uh, automatically fires a one damage beam that pierces all shields. And I think it spreads as, across as many rooms as possible. Alright. But you, you don't aim it at all. So, hmm. No, pretty much. There's a distress there, but it's right next to enemy territory, so probably give that a miss. 
No stores. I'm quite shocked by this so far, actually. No stores. You arrive at a populated sector. One merchant seems to be mass broadcasting a request for a mercenary ship to aid him. Shall we respond? Of course we shall. Your ship seems reasonably equipped. Uh, can you do this, actually? You're good at voices. You do the voices. <coughs> Your ship seems reasonably equipped. Afraid of carrying shipment from my goods is a week late. The fools threw to a pirate-filled sector in their haste, and I fear for the cargo's safety. I'm looking for a less competent, incompetent captain to investigate. I love how you fucked up the word incompetent. <laughs> <laughs> That's just... Well done, Tort. Well done. Well, well... What are we, the ascending failure? Uh, <laughs> yes, indeed. So let's jump on another one then. Uh, what have we got here? Should we attack the pirate or ignore them? Of course we're going to attack the pirate. I'm not even above asking you for your opinion on that one. <laughs> Combat drone. Okay, we might need to take down their drone systems first, but what have we got here? Mm. We've got a beam and a laser, so we'll go for that first. Then. Yeah, providing our shields recharge fast enough, I find the drones are actually not that much of a bother. Because look, he's, he's taking out one shield at a time. But then, oh, uh, did you see that? The drone and the single laser on the ship knocked our shields down to zero, but it recharged one level of shield just in time for the beam. Yeah, yeah. That's quite fluky. I used to find that happening to me a lot. If there's an anti-ship drone and I've got like two or three shields, then I'm actually don't need to worry about the drones. Unless they've got like repair drones or, or stuff like that that's going to stop me blowing them up. But that said, you can take any advice from me with a pinch of salt, because you've actually completed the game and I haven't. It all just takes practice. There's a certain element of luck though as well. And the artillery beam has just gone offline. Uh, we've just picked up it's two on missiles, fire. one drone, yep. And 18 scrap, and uh, they've given us some more stuff on top. It's okay. We opened up all the. No, yeah, we close all the doors. Let's send mod in to repair things once. There we go. Once there's some oxygen in there. <laughs> Still no stores. We can make one more jump before we have to exit. Hmm. How, how close do we have to be for the store to show up, actually? Within one jump, I believe. Ah. Uh. 56, so can we get another power bar, do you reckon? It would be handy. So we've got uh, more evasion going on. Yes, I agree. Uh, artillery beam, we'll get... If we get one more level of that, and we have a 40 second cooldown. Alright. But we'd still need the power to power it. I don't think we, we can afford that and power, so... We might save up the scrap first. We also desperately need repairing. Yes, agreed. Moving onwards then. Uh, stick the power in the. Uh, you forgot to stick the power on the FTL. I can still pause it. It's okay. <laughs> you detect a rebel automated ship nearby. It does not engage and seems to be patrolling around a long-range sensor station. Do we attack or avoid provoking? Let's attack the ship, shall we? Yeah, we we could do with the scrap. <laughs> there we go. I've just powered up the FTL just like you requested. Yeah. And they've got 20% two, evasion. Two lasers and it looks like hull lasers there and a missile launcher. Stop blowing holes and rush Oh. That's a pretty powerful AI. Um I've not seen one that well armed before. Those, they those they cannons do. are nasty. They do show up every now and again. Shields are back up to health. Let's take out their weapons again. Come on, Tort, do your job. If you've only got one job, fire that bloody laser. Do it. Do it quicker. Well, it's recharging as quickly as it can. It's quicker than if I wasn't there. And there goes the burst laser, and it's game over for the auto scout. Yeah. Ten scrap, and. For the Federation! Time to exit. Yeah, Next we're sector. getting quite close. I don't want to risk taking on the uh, the rebels with this state. In this state, I think it's worthwhile accepting this bribe. Um, I want you to do the voice again, sir. A missile shoots across your bow when the jump completes. Your scans quickly reveal a ship with pirate markings pursuing an unknown vessel. The pirate hails you. 
Damn it! We weren't expect. Wait a minute. Carry on. Fuck's sake, man. <laughs> I'm trying to think if that's us or them. The pirate oh. is hailing us. Oh, okay. Damn it! We weren't expecting company. Stay out of this, and you could profit. You are so sodding incompetent. <laughs> Do we accept their bribe or be a hero and attack them? Oh. They've got a laser and a beam. Actually, sod it. Let's attack them. Yeah. Yeah. Single laser. I mean, beam. To to me, if we were playing on easy, that's a shit bribe. But that I I, I I'm not sure on normal. That might have been a good bribe. I don't know. Well, let's just shoot the guns out and uh, not give them the choice. Uh, also, also, just on a roleplay value, I tend to just attack pirates because don't accept piracy. Um, but, there is uh, a oh, they can't just they can't defeat us. Their shield, their single laser can't get through our sh double shields. I told you it was a good <laughs> idea to get two levels of shields, but don't listen yeah. to me, will you? I... What? <laughs> That's bad. I never disagreed with you, especially on this game. Like I said, you've, you've beaten it and I haven't. I'll always defer to you. That's nice. Uh, we can't be having that, Star Fox. <laughs> Sorry, oh, I can't let you do that. That sounded really creepy and pervy. <laughs> Artillery beam is about to fire. Our FTL is ready. And there goes the artillery beam to rip it to pieces. Talk about overkill. 19 hey. scrap, that was a bit better. We're doing fine for fuel and missiles, so I'm happy with more scrap as a trade off. Yeah. Uh, oh, who repaired us? What? Thank the heavens you he showed up. We don't have much to offer as a reward, but our engineer should be proficient enough to patch your ship up a bit after that nasty fight. Nice! Yay! Next sector. Okay, Mantis controlled or uncharted. I hate nebulas, but um, Mantis. But Mantis. Are... <laughs> I was, I was actually gonna say go for the nebula, but never mind. 